Attention, California Fire Department Station 7. You are what? native for 1067 Forest at West Coast County. Let's go, Ryan. Ryan, wake up. What? Uh, Man, what? Grab two oh, saws. Oh. Grab two saws. Throw them in the back of your pickup truck. We Did you hear the alarm? Oh, man, we, got a, dead we got a forest <laughs> fire on the coast here. We're the closest unit to it. Let's go. Let's go. Get suited and booted. Get your, get your suit on. I'm all suited up. Take the pole. Here we go, boy. All right, Ryan. I'm thinking throw those two chainsaws in the back of your truck. I'm going to take the Toyota Land Cruiser. Okay, I think the train's passing by, too. We should be able to jump it. Let's uh, let's get going. Follow me. All right, boys. Let's go. Let's kick the tires. Let's light the fires. We got a forest fire. Sounds like it's an acre of land that's under danger right now, but it could spread very, very quickly. All right, the train's just about to pass. Perfect. We're going to head on out of here. All right, guys. We're heading down. Just got off the call with, with dispatch, so they went through. I'm on my computer here. I'm able to see everything we're heading west to the coast all right dispatch sounds like it's got a camping group that had a campfire and woke up to it early in the morning all right we're heading down there now we're the closest ones to it dispatch could you give me a better location on this fire it will be 108 west coast street in west coast county perfect thank you thank you what is the was it you said it was one acre of land that's in danger About that, yes okay sounds good i'm in route we're moving down the interstate heading west on i-30 Thank you. All right, boys, watch out. We got the popo on the side here trying to split the difference. There we go. We're heading over there now. This is going to be a big, a pretty bad one, it sounds like. And good thing they called it in. They called it in right away, and they said it is windy over there off the coast. That's one thing we're worried about. Dispatch gave me the address. We are cooking. We are moving. So I'm going to be over there soon. I'll probably pick back up, guys, once we get there. And this is, we're going to have hopefully other units there as well. But we were the closest wildlife fire forest fire rescue on the location so that's why we got called in let's get there all right guys we caught back up with ryan he's he's leading my way here so we we are moving there we go and then looks like looks at my rear view mirror we got some police officer behind us maybe it was this scene up here no you know what it is actually the dnr agent let's try and get him on call i bet he's on radio hey man are you the dnr there you are are you responding yeah, to a going? wired fire call yes sir force a force fire call i'll watch out all right yes, we sir. we're heading there right now as well go ahead all go right. ahead pass us we will be there in a little bit Right behind you, man. 10-4. I'll see you there. 10-4. All right, guys. We're tearing up the forest in our Toyota Land Cruiser. This thing is a beast. We're heading down there now. Dispatch did say this was rough terrain getting there, but I didn't think it was going to be this rough. Good thing we got the mud tires on. Holy biscuits and gravy. And we got the snorkel just in case. All right. And part of this is like an off-roading adventure. And then, so this is a campsite. We're heading down there right now. I don't know why my siren's on, but you know, just in case maybe a deer runs out in front of us, he gets spooked. But literally there's no one back here. All right, it's cement. Now, there's a fire. Gosh, dang it. That is big. Okay, what is this place? It's like a venture park campsite. All right, we're pulling in. Okay, that fire is... Uh, dude, that thing is crisping off. That is popping. That tree is... Oh, that's a Christmas tree right there. All right, we got a deputy on there. Holy crap, that was crazy getting here. We're covered in mud. Sir, are you the first one on scene? Yes, I am. Are you the... You're the deputy? Okay, cool, cool, cool. All right, dispatch told us somebody here was already on scene. Do you know what caused this? Was it a camper or something? Seems to be someone was driving along the road and they threw a cigarette out the window. Holy biscuits! It is dry out here. All right, it's it's right, pretty windy. Yeah. Where? Okay, the wind's coming out of the out of the east there, or no, out of the west. Okay, I'm all turned around. Okay, do you think we can? I got hoses in my trailer. I got hoses that can run 500 feet. Do you think I can get to that water so we can start pumping? I don't. I couldn't get any engine back here. Yeah, I measured it out when I first got here. It's about 500 feet. That. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. I'm gonna talk to my. One of my partners over here, he's getting his chainsaws ready. Stand for. All right, yo, yo, Ryan, grab the chainsaws out of the back of the truck. What my idea is, let's go ahead and see if we can take down the trees closest to the fire. Uh, it's because three, four of those trees are gone for sure. And then we're going to kind of go from there. I'm going to get hoses in the water, in the ocean there, and then we'll start pumping. Okay, okay. I'll see what I can do. Get, I'll see if I can get close enough to cool. uh, take one down. I'll, I'll come help you out in a bit. Just got on scene. What's the game plan? Yeah, so what we're doing right now is... We got three, four, five trees going. We're just going to try and maintain it. It's windy. Wind's blowing out of the coast, off the water. And mm -hmm. so we're going to try and keep this from spreading anymore. We got my partner here. He's going to go take out some trees. And I'm going to run some run some hoses up and get you know, spraying. There's a lot of mud on the ground. Do you think they just got some rain? Uh, There was a lot, but I think this is a park. I, I don't... This is a... I think they artificially make, the, make mud. It's like an yeah. off-roading park. Yeah, it's not... Everything's dry. All right. Yeah, because... It was pretty muddy. You can tell by looking at my truck on the way. Yeah, no, it was. It, I am too. It, I don't think yeah. that's... Well, it's a fire, man. We got to stop it. 
Doesn't yeah, matter if it's wet or dry. That's, so is there any civilians in the area that need to be evacuated? Nope. Uh, we didn't find anybody. Just a car right there. Okay. Do you want to... I'm going to start running lines and spraying. Yep. Do you need help with that? Yeah, come on, man. You're slow. Right. Let's go. All right, guys. We're starting to smoke this closest tree. What we're trying to do is just saturate the ground pretty much. Get it smoking. Those trees are big. If, if this starts to spread, what we're going to try and do... All right, this is pretty hot. What we're going to try and do is Ryan is starting to get some wedges in those trees. I might have to help him out too. Here, let me grab. He said the chainsaw over here. All right, it's hot. What I'm going to do is I'm going to just... I'm going to go ahead and chop down these trees real quick. Drop them timber. There we go. All right, this one's the closest to I think that one is done anyway. I'm not even going to try and chop that. There we go. Get her cut. Come on. Can't even hear my chainsaw over the... There we go. Get her dropped. Okay, that should be good. We're going to see if we can save the rest. There we go. Get my hose. Oh, he took down that tree. Dang. Okay, there we go. Hey, we're good. Don't take down any more. Man, watch out. It's too hot in there. Stay back, Ryan. Let me grab a hose real quick. Yep, everybody get a hose. We got three going. There we go. Smoke this ground right here on this tree that he dropped. There we go. Good, good. That one's out. There we go. Guys, I don't think I don't think we need to cut any more just because they're, they're no risk of spreading past these trees. So if we can have yeah. them survive, we're good. There we go. Hey, I'm running low on pressure. I'm I'll go off. back and yeah, get back. Hunt. There must be a kink. Must be, cause I'm getting. All right, there must be a kink in the line or something. I'm. It's like squirting a little bit. Oh, there we go. Okay. All right, that guy got it done. I didn't know that guy was just the first guy. He's a police officer. He must be. I didn't know if he was DNR or something. He had a weird truck too. Not your typical police officer truck. All right, this one is getting smoked. Holy crap! One of the trees just fell down. Watch out. Okay, that's kind of what we didn't want. Oh my goodness! One of the trees fell down. Crap! All right, that isn't good. It's gonna. Okay, that one's already pretty much burned up. All right, let's keep smoking it. All right, there we go. It's been like 10 minutes since I've. I the, my GoPro turned off, and then I just rebooted it with a new battery, and in the in the fire's really calmed down. So we're just smoking like literally all this stuff. Everything is pretty ashy. That tree we saved somehow, and then. All these I cut down, but that big one, this one right here, that fell on its own. Holy crap. That was intense. All right, boys, yeah. just keep smoking the ground. Get her nice and smothered. It should be, should feel and like I a found slip and some, slide uh, in here. Screech marks by that car as well. When I you found up. some what? Screech marks from tires. Oh, really? In the parking lot? Yeah, it was started by a cigarette, and I found the cigarette, but looks Yeah, it's super dry out here, guys. Let's, let's not risk this catching back up. We're going to be out here. For a few more hours just making sure everything's calm but just literally smoke the ground that was a that was one of the biggest fires Definitely. yet that tree was lighted up all the way to the top yeah ryan and then it fell down when it it was about to go um i thought it was i mean it was burn it was burning so hard and then just the base of it it just collapsed yeah, yeah. This, this ground over here is really dry i can hear i can hear the grass uh yeah for sure when we first got over here it was so hot i that's what i was worried about is like i mean it looks green but but it's pretty dry. And then, I, yeah. So it was smart, Ryan, that we got these cut. We just chopped these yeah, down. There's no that point. That first one was uh, the ground. Is, it was trying to spread over here to this big tree right here. I was going to get that one cut. Wasn't as hot as the one, uh, the big tree. No. Gotcha. Yeah. Well, we, I think we're, I think we're good. Ryan, make sure when we get back, you sharpen those chains and on those chainsaws. All right. Oh yeah. That's when I need it after that big tree. Yeah. That was, that was yeah. crazy. That also get yourself checked out by EMS2 there, Ryan. You kind of got near that. You might have uh, smoke inhalation. I could feel the blade was from up. the field. It was pretty intense. Yeah, no, I, I oh, saw yeah. it pulling in, and um, it was there was no good way to get here. I saw all your guys' trucks were muddier than even I, I was. Oh, yeah, I almost got stuck. This place is confusing. Yeah, it was, yeah, it was hard getting back here, and I think it's some sort of, like, mud off-road park. All right, guys, well, I'm going to go ahead and clean up the hoses. Me and Ryan are going to get yeah. uh, get everything. Yeah, yeah if you could help us out, man, I'd love it. So, yeah, then we're going to get back. So, you were, you were the DNR agent that passed us? Yeah, I was. Where were you, you coming out of? ahead of me at the gas station right down the road. Okay. What county do you Actually, service? Same, same county we're in right okay. now. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Dang, we, that was, that was coincidence. I, I, I was like, okay, DNR agent, forest fire. Uh, yeah. and, and so I was, and then I was on the same, you know, I, we were on that call. So I was like, yo, man, they called me out and they're like, there's possible people in the area. Mm -hmm. So I came cool guys. I am, uh, actually let's see. Uh, no, it's, it's probably fine. I was going to say, I was going to wash off my, 
wash up my rig there, but it's good. I don't think the hoses big... might not even stretch that far. I could always pull oh, it over here. Yeah. It's not a big deal. It's... But you're going to need a hand with the hoses? Yeah, we'll get those rolled up and back into okay. our, our trailer. But yeah, that's cool, guys. Thanks. Thanks so much for helping. Let's get those rolled up. Yeah, it was it was nice meeting you, man. Thanks for thanks for helping out. That that turned out a lot better than I thought when I first got here with the wind and everything. Yeah, I didn't. There wasn't really much for me to do. You uh, fire guys got here and got right on, right on the job. So, cool, man. Glad I could have been here to help out. Yeah, yeah. Thanks. Well, good luck for the rest of the day or the rest of your shift, man. Stay safe out there. Yeah, let's hope. Uh, let's hope we don't get too much more crazy. Yeah, for sure. Have a good one. All right, guys, we're heading out. We are a filthy mess. Look at that guy's dodge. He got muddy, too. Um, so, yeah, we are heading back out. Back to the station. It's It, it was like a 25-30-minute like drive. Um, once we get out here is what took so long. It's, it's a weird place out here. So, it's like there's like mudding spots and like hill climbs and it's like you pay i think it's like you pay a fee to be out here and like these guys take care of it make really cool mud like i've seen videos of it on like youtube and instagram and stuff and i've, I've never been out here uh and i didn't know this was it but it's pretty cool looking around here they have some pretty crazy stuff but thank you all so much for watching today's episode more fire and police videos coming and again huge shout out to lambo mods for making this map making a lot of the mods we use in today's today's episode so i want to give a big shout out to them thank you so much lambo and hit subscribe like comment a lot of you guys watching aren't subscribed so please do subscribe i appreciate it very much and i'll see you all in the next fire episode